Hey, what's going on church family? It's Sean Shetler here and I have an awesome video for you. I wanted to give you um, a little kind of a summary of a, a paper I wrote for seminary and um, it's called The Power of Our Testimony and it's a short paper so I wanted to read some sections out of it just to give you an idea. It's really powerful so I thought it would be awesome to share. Revelation 12:11 proclaims, And they have conquered him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony, for they love not their lives even unto death. This verse highlights the profound impact of personal testimony in overcoming adversity and advancing God's kingdom. By sharing our experiences of divine intervention and transformation, we participate in the spiritual victory described in this, in this scripture. A contemporary illustration of the transformative power of testimony is John's story. Names have been changed to respect privacy. Shared during a sermon at First Baptist Church of Marble Falls, Texas in April 2024, John detailed how Jesus restored his marriage to Mary, offering a compelling narrative of reconciliation and divine intervention. By the end of the sharing of his testimony, there was not a dry eye in all of the sanctuary. Everyone had snot and buckets of tears falling down the side of their face. This testimony exemplifies the essence of Revelation chapter 12, verse 11, showing how the blood of the Lamb and the word of one's testimony can lead to profound personal and relational healing. Dr. Ross Chandler relevantly describes such experiences, noting, Occasionally we get a fleeting glimpse on earth, when the air is thin and there is a narrow space between heaven and earth. This metaphor captures those rare transformative moments when divine reality intersects with our human experience, providing glimpses of God's grace and power that are otherwise obscured by everyday life. Personal testimonies often reveal these moments, offering powerful insights into the nature of divine intervention. I hope this message was a blessing. Thank you.